Tonight with a health alert, an outbreak of a rare infection in Wisconsin. 18 people dead, dozens more sick. NBC 26's Ashley Barnes is investigating what it is. She's live in the newsroom with who should be concerned. Stacy, the infections are caused by a bacteria called the Elizabeth Kingia. This type of bacteria rarely affects illnesses in humans, but it's linked to deaths in the southern part of the state, as close as Fond du Lac County. 18 people dead after testing positive for the Elizabeth Kingia bacteria. But experts say it's not something healthy people should fear. It may be that, you know, otherwise healthy individuals are able to fight off this type of a bacteria. All of the 44 people infected in Wisconsin since November had pre-existing health conditions, many over 65 years old. But it's not clear if those who passed away with the bacteria in their bodies died because of it or other serious health problems they had. The Centers for Disease Control is working with the State Department of Health to figure it out. They're looking for in information about where patients have been. It's a very broad investigation at this point. But there has been one good answer in that investigation. It is not spreading person to person. We know that it is not um, something that is in the air, like a cold or a flu or something like that. And that leads Dr. Angelo Colakithas of Northeast Wisconsin Technical College to an idea of where the bacteria could have come from. Whenever we see outbreaks of antibiotic resistant bacteria in this age population, we start to think of healthcare acquired infections. The Department of Public Health isn't ruling out that source, but says it needs more time to investigate. And symptoms include fever, shortness of breath, and chills. So if you experience these and are a senior with a compromised immune system, you might want to see a doctor right away. Reporting live in the Green Bay Newsroom, keeping you connected, Ashley Barnes, NBC 26.